Welcome to the Only Fools and Horses podcast. Only Fools and Horses fan, Ross Keeley. How's it going? Going uh, very well. Yourself? Yeah, very good. Ready for the quiz? As ready as I'll ever be. Great. <laughs> for all we know, he could be part of Al Qaeda. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, does he look like he works in a furniture store? <laughs> So what was that clip? Uh, uh, strangers on the shore. Well done. One out of one so far. On to Thank clip you. two. God bless you, my son. <laughs> Miracle of Peckham. Yeah, well done. Yeah, Miracle of Peckham. Very funny episode, wasn't it? On shore. <laughs> uh... I've forgotten the words. Bunny boiler. What's it called? Um... It's hard when you've got to name the episodes, isn't it? Oh, my God. Fatal Extraction. There you go. Well done. Yeah, you need oh, a little bit of time, thing, but you got there. The words just completely, completely didn't, you know, didn't come into there. It was on the tip of my iceberg. That's all right. Yeah. Well done. Three out of three so far. What? What's this? What's this little boat there? Hey, John, where's Holland? <laughs> Mr. Holland Ajax. <laughs> Ajax. Is, of course. The Holland back. Yeah, Holland back. On the Inge. Odell boy. Long time, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice easy one, that one. That's made the force be with you. Yeah, Roy Slater's first appearance. Absolutely. Slater. I'll give you a nice tan, all right? <laughs> How can we forget that one? That's obviously tea for free. Yeah, tea for free. Well done. Doing very well. Six out of six. Got fished out by the Germans. Spend the rest of the war in the stalle. Fancy that one, too. <laughs> Got a feeling yeah, you'll get this the, one. One of the best. That's Jolly Boys out and that's him in the halfway house. Yeah, brilliant. One of the best episodes, isn't it? Oh, I reckon so. Right, she's even too old for me. <laughs> well, I'd have to think twice. <laughs> you know it. No great, no greater love. There you go. You got it. No greater oh, love. It took God. you a little while, but you got it. It was in there. It was in there, wasn't it, eh? All I ever got for Christmas was an orange and a clump and a year old. <laughs> Still, the orange was nice. Well, I th it's, a, it's a hard clip, that one, because there's not a lot to it. But I think it's one of my favourites because it's filmed in my hometown of Brighton. Uh, I think it's Mother Nature's Son. Brilliant. Yes, well done. I thought you might stumble at that one, but you did very well, well to get that. I almost did, but it was, to be fair, you've got, obviously, three men and a lady and a baby, obviously... And then the next one is, so he, 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 you know, he had to be that sort of age, didn't he? Yeah, such a fantastic episode, isn't it, with the Peckham Spring? Absolutely. And as I say, filmed in my... Uh, Grand my, Hotel. My Grand Hotel, the, the, there's the, the Nags Head, outside the Nags Head, where uh, Trigger and Denzel put their hand up. That's a local pub literally about a mile away from me. Oh, great. No, I didn't know so, that. Not there anymore, but... It was, and, yeah. Uh, yeah, Miles's food shop's just up the road as well. Great. Yeah. I remember that um, that scene was done at the Grand Hotel, but I didn't realise the pub was in Brighton as well. Yeah. yeah. It used to be called the White Admiral in a place called Bevin Dean. Oh, but it's not there anymore. It's flats, would you believe? Oh, that's a shame. Isn't Doc it? Dockers Mansions. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dockers Mansions. <laughs> my name's not Dave. My name's Rodney. I thought it was Dave. <laughs> you sure? Okay, this is the episode with Basil in it on the committee. It's him get, them getting a bungalow because Grenad's legs. And I'm sure I know the answer, but for the life of me, it has escaped me. And it's not sitting with some wealth because that's obviously Del Boy. Oh, it's 
not happy returns. It is not second time around. It's in it's in between. It's in between. I'm gonna kick myself when I um No, nope, I'm gonna have to give up. I can't think of it. Oh. What a shame. Oh, I really man. thought you was gonna do it. Oh man, I thought I was gonna do it. I thought I was gonna lay down the gauntlet. I'll let you know what it is. It's homesick. Of course it is. Yeah. Of course it is. This is the ah. episode with Grandad, isn't it? He can't go up. Living, He's making out great. that he can't get up the flights of stairs and he becomes yeah. a councilman. Uh, I thought I was going to get my 10 out of 10. I thought I was going to lay down the gauntlet. Of, uh, I, wanted, uh, Edwin, the first. Uh, I wanted Edwin Morris to have a go. He is going to have a go. Good, He's going to have a go next week. Oh, that's good news. And what we're going to do is, at the end of it, whoever gets the highest scores will do it again, but there'll be sort of harder clips, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we can work out who the champion is sort of thing. So, a top dog. Great. Well, thanks a lot for playing. I'll get this edited. No, and then thanks a I'll lot put, for that, mate. It, it was a lot of fun. Hook is dream.